hey you guys welcome back to my channel zx2 here for you and if you're new thanks for tuning in so let's just get straight into this video i'm going to walk you guys through it as quickly as i can so as you guys can see i am just going to tone this wig out by using the purple lighting shampoo shimmering shampoo i think that's how you call it but yeah I'm just gonna wash this out and let it sit for a good five, 10 minutes. Okay, you guys, now that that is done, I am ready to blow dry this hair just so I can get started with the next part of dyeing it. But first, I will be toning this extra bundle that I will be adding. And here I'm just showing you guys how I toned it out as well. I will be adding it with a double weft, which I'm showing you guys right here. And um, I'm gonna do a double weft and then I'm gonna do single, two single ones towards the top. And that's pretty much what I do. And like I said, you guys, I am trying to rush through this video as quickly as possible because I do not want it to be long for you guys. So yeah. Here, I'm just showing you guys me getting everything that I need to get started on dyeing this hair. So, let's do this. I'm adding this Vaseline. As you guys can see, I did spray the Got To Be Glue yellow bottle hairspray, but um, for extra protection, I did add this Vaseline and I feel like I did too much. But anyways, Let's get started with this hair dye. I'm adding a little bit of the 40 volume developer and I'm just gonna mix it around um, and get started you guys. And let me tell you guys, I was as gentle as possible. I really, really tried not getting not a single drop on this lace and um, yeah you guys i was very careful i went as slow as possible i took my time and i was just patient with it and um yeah you guys are gonna watch me do this until i hit the other side of this wig and i'm starting off by sections and i'm starting off with the lace part of this wig which is the 13 by 4 lace part of this wig so yeah you guys are gonna see me do this first and then move on to the back side of the wig and y'all gonna see me do that in a few minutes right after I'm done with this portion so you guys just keep watching I hope you guys are enjoying the video and sorry for the video being so long but I really wanted to show you guys step by step on what I did to achieve this, you know, this hair dye, this hair, this hair dye look, you know, this is new to me. I'm new to this. It's the first time I'm doing this. So bear with me as well. <laughs> I'm not a professional, but you guys, thanks for the support and thanks for watching. You guys, keep watching and see what I do next.
guys let me just pop up and apologize again for this video being so long I just really wanted to get into detail as quickly as possible on the step that I took to get this wig together so again I apologize but you guys keep watching because the end results are awesome and again thanks for watching Hey you guys, so here we are finished with this portion of the wig. And as you guys can see, nothing leaked through. Thank God for that. So I'm just gonna sit her here over this aluminum foil. I am gonna sit her for like a good, I actually let her sit for like a good 40 minutes, to be honest. So, boom. On to the washing process and um let me just say you guys the vaseline did the job but it was so difficult trying to really get this vaseline off the lace you know it worked out i eventually got it all out but it didn't come out the first time let me just say that but look at how great and beautiful she came out i love i love how she came out and here i'm just going to show you guys the end result of that portion and y'all be the judge of it let me know what you guys think okay you guys let's get it we're in the back now i did start without you guys because like i said i'm really trying to rush through this video because i'm pretty sure you guys um could tell what i'm doing at this point i am just dyeing the roots of this wig with this color and you guys if you guys want more information on the type of colors that i use let me know i will put them down in the description box if it's you know necessary but y'all let me know if y'all if y'all would like to know what type of the color of the dye that i used i will put that down um yeah so yeah you guys keep watching i'm going to fast forward as quickly as possible because i'm pretty sure you guys get the drift all right y'all keep watching Alright you guys, 
we're on to the second color here and I just wanted to share with you guys that this is the first time that I'm doing this um, I just learned by watching YouTube channels and getting all the tips and tricks that I could and this is just the way that I decided to dye this wig and it worked out for me and yeah you guys I hope you guys liked keep watching the video is almost over show you guys how she is looking at this point and look at this lace I am very excited about it as you can see just because nothing went through it all went perfect and the Vaseline with the got to be glue spray actually did work but like I said taking the Vaseline out of this lace was uh was some work but it did the job like i said so yeah you guys y'all let me know how y'all let me know how it looks but keep watching condition these are the end results y'all let me know what you guys think and this is how she is looking like I just gave her a quick little press and um, yeah you guys I'm very excited I love how she came out you guys let me know thank you again you guys so much for watching y'all leave a comment like and seriously, let me know how she did. Let me know. I would definitely try this again on another week. But y'all be the judge of this. Thank you so much for watching, y'all. Have a good one. <laughs>